Welcome to Bishkek, the capital of Kyrgyzstan. I just arrived today and immediately started exploring the center. And here behind me, you can see one of the main buildings here in the city and a statue of a guy that I don't know. His name is Aymatov. Must be a pretty important person for the people of Kyrgyzstan. And also you can see some banners all around about the Second World War, referring to 1941 and 1945. And up there you can see the flag of Kyrgyzstan. But actually why I came to this place is because of the main square which is here on the other side. But as you can see it is totally fenced off. I guess they're doing some kind of renovations. But in the back there you can see the national hero of Kyrgyzstan that is Manas. And before Manas was there, in the Soviet Union time, there was a statue of Lenin and this square was called Lenin Square. And now it's called Ala 2 Square, if I'm not mistaken. Let's try anyway to see if we can get any closer to the statue. But we will have to go and walk all around this fenced off area here. Here we can also see the typical Soviet Eastern buses, the Mashrutkas. And there definitely is a Soviet vibe. Look at these banners here. It's super hot in Bishkek, it's over 30 degrees. We're going to cross the street here. Seems like the buses and even the cars stop for us, so let's hurry a bit. Seems like this is a more modern bus. It says even a Bishkek in uh, the alphabet that I use. Let's walk through this little passage here. I've seen a little opening here in the fence so we can have a look how the square actually looks. Maybe let's not enter the square, but we can have a look around. So we can see these impressive banners here. And here we can see they broke off all the stairs. They're probably going to renovate it all. We have a lot of fountains here. That's where I was before, standing on the other side. And you can see this is the little square. Then there's a very big boulevard here. And there we have Mr. Manas. And that's the State History Museum behind him. But no flagpole. Normally there is a flagpole and a change of the guards every hour. I'm a bit sad that I'll have to miss that. Behind Manas we can see a Ferris wheel. There is some kind of typical Soviet theme park. Something I always like to explore, so we might go there later. Let's cross the street, see if the car stopped for me. That's pretty nice actually. Seems like the car stopped for the pedestrian path. Uh, you can see it's a beautiful summer day. It looks like we can go to Manas though. I see some other tourists walking there. These workers have a very loud machine, but I think you can still hear me. And this is the statue of Manas. 